Adrian Gonzalez, the former U of L D C I S D police officer, faces 29 counts of abandoning and endangering a child. That includes survivors and the children who died at Robb Elementary. According to the indictment, Gonzalez was advised of the general area where the shooter had time to respond, but it states he failed to engage, distract, and delay the shooter until after the gunman entered rooms 111 and 112. Court documents state Gonzalez also failed to abide by his active shooter training that directs officers to move toward the gunfire. As for the former Uvalde CISD police chief, Pete Arredondo, he's been charged with 10 counts of abandoning and endangering a child. The indictment against him details an overall lack of leadership to command the scene, which includes not distributing breaching tools in time for law enforcement to barge into the classrooms. Oscar Arona, father of Noah, who survived the shooting, met with the district attorney today. He says he learned why there were only two indictments, but he couldn't dive into specifics. However, he is optimistic about the justice system. You know, I hope that uh, uh, there's justice. All of this stuff is important, don't get me wrong, but we choose to focus on my son. Both Gonzalez and Arredondo have since bonded out of jail. Zach Briggs, Ken's 5.